Hello friends, it is day 10 for the microgreen grow. Microgreens are looking pretty good. The odor issue that I had uh, in the last video, it does seem to diminish a little bit as the um, plants are growing, probably as the roots start uh, taking up water. Here you can see the uh, basic salad mix did not do so well. I think it, uh, if you look at this area, I think they just got flooded and drowned. Um, so the response there is to uh, use a screen, which is pretty easy to do. They've been uh, running about between 71 and 73 uh, degrees Fahrenheit. It's a little bit cooler than I would like, but it is well within the range of acceptable temperature. These have been stacked for five days. Let's uh, unstack them and see what it looks like. Sunflower is looking pretty good. That's for day five, not day four like I used to do. But uh, here you see the basic salad mix did not do well and clearly I need a screen. So I'm still working on my my methods and um, I'm going to be out of town on and off so I won't be able to continue my trials uh, um, for some time and so you probably won't see some videos. Uh, if you want to know how to successfully grow uh, microgreens using hydroponic methods, you go to Hydroponic Gardening and More with Brent. Uh, Brent has got a very good system that uh, he's perfected over many, many uh, crops and uh, and he's got something that will work the first time if you follow his method. I'll get there. Um, my crops do have some failures, but you know, I'm doing the, this, I'm putting my trials on the internet and uh, it's not always pretty but uh, I know what I need to do in this case I need to put screens under the uh, uh, smaller seeds like broccoli and uh, basic salad mix and another thing I'm going to do is uh, start out with straight water not hydroponic mix for the first five days or so and uh, then um, then I'll do some testing, but I'll probably use hydroponic mix for the rest of the time, or maybe just for a few days and then go back to straight water. Um, other than that, pretty happy with how the sunflowers came out, and uh, the uh, salad mix could have been good if it had been on a screen. And so I think I've, uh, I'm going down the successful path um, and uh, trying to put together a system that requires very little maintenance and can be automated. So almost there. Um, look back in a month or so and uh, I will be back at it and uh, pretty sure I will find some success with this system. Thank you for watching.